Did you happen to walk up on your rabbit eating its own poop and you were totally grossed out and wondered what in the world is my rabbit doing? Don't worry about it, I'm going to get all that cleared up for you in today's video, so stick around. Hey guys, welcome back to another Slightly Rednecked video. Again, my name's Chris. If you're not familiar with this channel, I help you to produce your own meat, eggs, and vegetables from your backyard, your balcony, your deck, your garage, or heck, even a spare room in your house if that's the way you want to go about it. And today we're talking about a topic that may be a little bit gross to some people, and that's why do rabbits eat their own poop? Well, it's actually a very healthy thing for them to do, and it's not that they eat their own poop all the time. It's a certain kind of manure that they produce, not even manure really, but a certain kind that they produce about once a day, sometimes called night feces, or a better, more scientific term for that is a sesiotrope. Sesiotrope, there we go. Sesiotrope, if I can get the word out right. And it's a specific type of feces that they produce. And really the way that this works for the rabbits is that kind of like a cow were to store its food up in its stomach, roll it around all day, and then at night it spits it back up and chews its cud, what we call cud, and then you know digests it that way. That's how they digest their food. Same kind of thing with rabbits in a way, not exactly, but similar. As food passes through the digestive tract, they don't necessarily absorb all the nutrients out of it. So some of that gets stored away in their digestive tract, ferments a little bit, and then gets expelled as what we call a sesotrope. And it looks a little different than a regular ra uh, rabbit pellet or rabbit dropping. I don't have any pictures of that because they pretty much always eat it. You hardly ever see them actually do it, but you might run across it from time to time. Kind of looks, um, it's a little bit shinier. It's going to have, it looks like maybe if you took uh, four or five, maybe six regular uh, rabbit droppings and kind of smashed them together and kept them kind of wet, kind of shiny and kind of wet. I'm talking to somebody uh, that posted a picture of one and I'm trying to get permission to post that. If I get permission, it'll be right here. If not, you're just gonna have to take my word for it or Google it, look it up. You'll find plenty of pictures for it to see what it looks like. But basically what that allows the rabbits to do is to take all that nutrients that they missed the first time around, they eat that, and it's way higher in protein, way higher in fiber than their other droppings, and that gives them a chance to kind of reabsorb all those nutrients that go into their system. It's actually a pretty important part of their diet, so it's not something that you wanna take away or discourage your rabbits from doing, just let them do it. Chances are you probably won't ever see it anyway, because it's they pretty much eat it just as soon as it comes out. Um, you might see your rabbit kind of, um, well, pulling it out themselves with their mouth. <laughs> kind of a gross thing to look at or think about, but it's really completely normal, very, very healthy for your rabbits to do, and it's something that they actually need to do. Especially your young. You'll notice sometimes your young rabbits, your, uh, you may think that the uh, mother rabbit is using the nest box as a litter box, when actually what she's doing is depositing sesotropes for the young rabbits to develop their digestive system on. So it's really kind of something that's pretty cool in nature. Just uh, most people don't know about it because it's so rare that you actually don't get to see it very often. Well, I hope that puts your mind at ease if you were freaked out by seeing your rabbit eat that stuff. If you have more questions or any other thing, topics you want to see covered, leave me a comment down below. I will do my best to answer those or get those topics covered for you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video and all my videos. And as always, God bless.